Everyone knows the importance of prestige for their business, so why should I register my trademark? Well, there are three simple reasons. One, it would help you to prevent third parties from using your trademark. Two, it is the best and safer way to exploit your intangible assets in any country. And three, trademarks are a very cost-effective tool for internationalization that allow local consumers to know your product and your company prior to establishing a subsidiary in the country. What trademarks should I register? The decision should rely on a balance between costs and impact in the local market. Moreover, prior to deciding what trademark do you want to register, you must consider what trademark is more representative of your goods and services, what trademark may have more impact in the local market, what trademark has the highest international projection, and what will your communication strategy in the country or region be. Once analyzed, you may opt between register only your company name as a trademark, register only those trademarks related to the goods and services, launch a new trademark in the country, or a combination of all three. In any case, bear in mind that in most Latin American countries, lack of use of the trademark may lead to the expiration of the trademark. Therefore, it is advisable not registering those trademarks that you would not use or and make an effort to use all your registered trademarks in the countries at hand. When should I register my trademark? As soon as you plan to use it in the country. Remember that registration procedures in Latin America tend to be longer on average than in Europe. On the other hand, early registration will allow you to detect existing trademarks that may conflict with yours and prevent bad faith registrations. Indeed, starting the commercialization of products bearing a trademark that a third party has privileged registered may imply incurring an extra cost, such as litigation costs or withdrawal costs. Hacking consequence. How should I register my trademark? It is advisable to follow these five simple steps. One, decide what type of sign are you going to register. Take into account that not all Latin American countries accept non-conventional trademarks like three-dimensional or smell trademarks. Two, Conduct a preliminary search to assess if there is a prior, identical, or similar sign that may conflict with your application. Once you have the results, you may be in a good position to decide whether you are interested in applying for the trademark as it is, include distinctive elements to prevent confusion with other prior signs, acquire already existing trademarks, sign a coexistence agreement with prior trademark holders, not accepted by all the countries by the way, or apply for a totally different sign. 3. Apply for registration, taking into account whether it is mandatory to appoint an attorney or not, fees, deadlines, translations, and any other specific requirements which must be analyzed on a country-by-country -country basis. 4. Follow up the granting procedure with special care in which concerns publications in official bulletins, formal and substantive objections, and third parties' oppositions. And finally, 5. Use, exploit, and renew your trademark. Usually, trademarks in Latin America should be renewed every 10 years, counted from the granting date.